Do you know during the Great Depression, one of the things that happened was people needed a comic relief. Some of the greatest comedic acts happened during the Great Depression. There were the Marx Brothers, you had the Three Stooges, you had Our Gang, which became Little Rascals, you had Amos and Andy. Some of you are old enough maybe to remember those, uh, those acts, and you got a good laugh out of it. Well, those all came up during the Great Depression because as people were sad, they needed comic relief. So I thought during this pandemic, what better way than if I could bring you some comic relief? Now, I hope you get at least a smile out of this. But number one is the mask. Everybody's talking about the mask, how we need the mask. But you know, the thing is I've noticed is how people don't know how to wear the mask. The improper ways of wearing a mask. For example, some people, they wear it. Deacon Joe's gonna come and show us how they wear it. And what do you notice about Deacon Joe in his mask wearing? His nose isn't covered. That's the primary way the virus gets into a person. The other way, I saw this one today, someone was hanging their mask from their ear. Well, that's not gonna do anything. I've seen masks where it's over the chin. I've seen masks on the neck. I see even masks on top of people's heads. But the number one improper way of wearing a mask is all I see are people doing this. I'll get it there in a minute. They're constantly doing this. The big thing about never to do is to touch your face or your mask with your hands. Who knows where your hands have been and touched and gotten? But yet I see people doing this all the time. One of the worst things. So in order to help you in this situation, I have devised a mask that will keep you from touching your face. I call it the cone of COVID. And here is the cone of COVID. See, the cone of COVID. Now when I go to touch my face, I can't get at my mask because it's the cone of COVID has kept me safe. So I pray and hope that you will invest yourself in a cone of COVID. If you need some help designing it or buying it, please get a hold of me. And I pray and hope that this has brought a little comic relief to you. Let's pray. Father in heaven, what a beautiful and a glorious day you've given us. The pandemic has kind of been a bummer for us, but yet, Lord, you bring a smile to our face when you bring people who bring a little comedy into us. And I pray that, Lord, my little comedy act here has helped bring a smile to someone's face. We just pray, Lord, to bring this virus to an end and help people to be able to get back together again without masks, without cones of COVID or anything else where we can truly love one another with hugs and a kiss on the cheek and just a shaking of the hand. But all, Lord, in good time, just guide us and lead us in your grace. In Jesus we pray. Amen.